step one is separating the cable into two pieces. And what you need to do is take approximately half of it and unwrap it from the rest other half of it. As you see, we are just unbraiding the cable. We have three external and a center rope, and we have three externals. Um, depending on the size and the, and the uh, construction of the cable, you'll have uh, five, seven, or nine total segments. Generally, we have seven on most of the ag tables that we use. Um, each size cable you will unwrap a different amount of cable. On a one inch cable, thank you. On a one inch cable, uh, we unbraid approximately five feet. And then you take the cable and you bring it back around like a loop and you pull the tail through here and then you bring it back down so your loop is approximately that size. And then you need to start this um, cable into the other cable. Uh, I think here. It takes a little bit to get it, it take, to lay it right. It takes a little bit to get it to lay right. I'm going to undo this because I don't have quite enough length unwrapped. I was trying to make the loop too small. Alright, we'll go that way. Right Don't take poppies to that. Alright, you need to move back, young man. Back up, Chris. have a foot or two of tail sticking out at the end of here because that's where you get your strength from. Once you get your first rebraid like that, bring that tail back through here. When you get the cable to lay back on top of itself like that, you are started and ready to finish your rebraid. After that, it's pretty simple. Just make sure that your three strands of cable go where they need to go each time you go around. Stop. 